Ah, well, jumped it. <laughs> All right. So for this year's Onyx Off-Road Build Challenge, we are building a 2002 Mini Cooper Model S. It is a supercharged six-speed, and we will be putting in a five-cylinder Mercedes diesel. Except the donor doesn't run yet. <laughs> nope. Let's go get it running. All right. Here she is. This is, what year is this? Me, you're the one who bought it. Mercedes turbo diesel. All right, how do we pop this thing? You wanna pop that? Oh yeah. I bought this car for 250 bucks. 250 bucks in all of her glory right there. <laughs> yeah, I kind of don't even know what it needs. Just so we do, do we just, should we just put power to it and just yep. crank her? Throw some fuel in it and some starting fluid. It's turbo. There's a little baby turbo in there. And if you look, well, you can't see it. <laughs> if you look in there, you can't see it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you tried real hard, at least. <laughs> it is a turbo, though. It is a turbo. So... Yeah, fuel. Where's the fuel filler upper? <laughs> That's nice. Oh, there's some stuff. Why does that look like fish scales? That probably is fish oil. Or Pour that sucker in, dilute it. Wait, why is it red? <coughs> ah, this is an off-road vehicle. <laughs> if you couldn't tell. I couldn't. No. That's probably my bad. There we go. That's racing gas right there. Heck yeah. Might as well take it to the drag strip and blow everyone out of the water before we put it in the Mini Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> Something tells me this is going to be pathetic. <laughs> is, there supposed to be a, is there supposed to be a battery in this spot? Or do you think it'll just run?
turned it off. Oh. Not that one. Where's the kill for this thing? Yeah. Whoops. Mm. <laughs> okay, so the shutoff circuit's not working. Period. This is a good sign. She's gonna do good in the Mini Cooper. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's right where it's supposed to be. Bill, put some of that stuff in there. Let's see if I can watch it through the camera. Oh, I missed. That's, turns that's... out, oh, turns out I missed. Oh, don't worry, I made it. Hmm. May or may not have been just bone dry. So how do we, uh, do we have another battery here? Then what, what do we do? How do we get this in? Um, take the hood off. I mean, what? <laughs> I like the way you think, Zach. <laughs> Let's do it. This bad Larry's rear wheel drive, too. It is? Yeah. We can weld the diff on this. <laughs> okay. Oh no! Oh dear! Oh great heavens! I don't think Mercedes had us in mind when they were building this. Wow! Dude, that's clean! I mean, it's oily, but it's. Yeah, I, I was expecting a rat nest, if I'm being honest. Huh. Crazy. Nice. Let's drive it. What? Does this thing adjust the mirror? Bro, that's crazy. Well, you um, can adjust the mirror from in here. We need a jump box. Hmm. Battery's dead. Oh. Well. Okay, start her up. You ready? <laughs> Not as ready as you, apparently. Oh, I'm I'm so ready. <laughs> Here we go. What's S? I know what L is, but what's S? S is speed. Second. <laughs> now S is definitely speed. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> Proceed. 
key doesn't shut it off. What the heck are you doing? <laughs> what are we doing? Having fun. This thing sounds so awful. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing on the inside works. Period. Like, half of the dash works. Some of them, oh. like, no lights. There's a crack. Wow. Yeah, it's coming from there under there. Yeah, that box is toast. Yeah. But uh, radio doesn't work. AC doesn't work. Like, blower motor doesn't work. This thing scoots, though. This, it actually it gets with it. It so good. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Wow. Dude, did you hear the turbo? Yeah. I was getting yeah. ready for, like, you know when the back end, you just lose momentum, and it just starts kind of spinning and just, yeah. bleh, that's it what was, I was it expecting was hanging it to do, with it. but it just kept going. I was like, holy crap. Oh, that was awesome. Wow. So, for the first time since I've been at this shop, this concrete pad has been cleaned. You know something fun's about to go down. This could get interesting. Commence the shenanigans. I'm gonna say it like this. Commence the shenanigans. <laughs> well, that was, that was. I don't know how I feel about that one. Ah. gonna be so cool all right so we're welded up the diff on the Mercedes because Zach wants to do real drifts apparently and we'll we see whether or not we're actually good enough drivers to real drift or not there it is put some grease on the ring gear so that we wouldn't get like spatter stuck on it um, and that goes in right there okay Zach is Zach go ahead and tack attack it oh, might catch on fire I so I need you to like run yeah. if it does Putting the cover back on, fill it up with oil. Zach got it all welded up real nice. Hopefully it lasts longer than 10 minutes. He's doubting, but <laughs> believe in this thing. This little baby diff is gonna be just fine. Is it, is it really that heavy? <laughs> Can't tell if you're being dramatic or not. <laughs> Okay. I Dude, think, it's heavy. I think you're being you think I'm being dramatic? No. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> okay. Let's both pick it up and Janelle can twist Where's it another on. bolt? <laughs> Dude, come on. You, I can't pick it up anymore. <laughs> you can't pick it up any further? Here. <laughs> wow. Man, okay. you're tough. <sighs> Bam, welded. This is a drift car now.
was a good idea, wasn't it? Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. You may or may not have noticed that today's video was actually filmed a couple weeks ago, but it just didn't fit in the timeline of posting things until now. But nonetheless, it was a ton of fun getting the Mercedes running and driving. It didn't actually need anything at all, it just needed a jump. But uh, welding the diff and taking it drifting, drifting, you can make fun of us if you want because it was a little bit pathetic, but it was still fun. I think you're gonna agree too. You're gonna wanna tune in again tomorrow morning because that's when we're really kicking off the Mini Cooper build and turning it into the coolest off-roader in the world. At least that's what I'm gonna call it. Compared to the other competitors, we're starting this build late, but I wanna let you know right now that we are hot on their tails. That is a sneak peek update. And for that, I ask that you go vote for us at onyxoffroad.com. So, and just like last year's Onyx Offroad Build Challenge, you could vote for your favorite team to the top. And last year you guys did amazing. And this year, I know you guys can do the same. You can either make an account for free, you can use your existing account, or if you want to try Onyx Offroad and download the app and use it, you can use the link in my bio and it will save you 20% off on your membership. And of course, with all that, I have to thank you for your support and thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Alrighty, so since Zach like doing Brody's in the gravel parking lot, we're gonna make him use this workhorse, this turbo diesel right here, to smooth it out. Carry on. edge right <laughs> right here and hold the chains up to put pressure on it otherwise it'll flip and if it flips just let go <laughs> and wear your sunglasses came loose and it <laughs> popped out. I'm like, oh, we didn't even get to the rough stuff. Oh well, bummer deal. What time is it? We got time. 48. We got time. That was quite the event. Right <laughs> I'm, I'm so sad. I turned the camera off right before oh, it happened. It like started rolling and I like tried to lean back harder and then it just, I was like, oh, shoot. <laughs> It had you sideways there for a second too. Yeah, you were like laying on the ground when I looked back. Dude, get some sides. We, we should do this more often. Why? It's gravel. <coughs> All right. Well, that's a wrap, but uh, I can't wait to get this motor pulled out of this car and stuffed into the Mini Cooper. I have a feeling it's gonna be fun. I am a little bit sad that we're gonna be ruining this car, but. There's nothing, nothing in this car works. The tail lights and headlights work, but nothing on the interior of the car. And <coughs> it's, it's just ratted out. It's all nasty. This, uh, this motor needs, needs a good home. Not us, but we have it. So <laughs> that's too bad. Until then, thanks for watching. <laughs>